If you're a plant junkie like me, having the option to hang plants in baskets not only adds visual interest to your backyard, but also provides you with a place to put additional plants when your regular garden beds and patio pots are already overflowing. Hanging baskets are susceptible to drying out and being damaged by wind and weather, but they may be protected from these elements in shady regions. This is a list of suitable plants and flowers for use in shady hanging baskets. Number one, Western Bleeding Heart. Tolerant of temperatures from zone three to zone eight. For several weeks in late spring and early summer, Western Bleeding Heart provides a beautiful backdrop with its arching branches and hanging heart-shaped blossoms. Dappled sunlight or partial shade is ideal for them. The Western Bleeding Heart is one of the more drought-resistant varieties of this plant, making it a reliable option for hanging in a wicker basket. Number two, Lobelia. Known for its profusion of flowers from spring to summer and into fall. This small annual can be used to fill in empty spots in a hanging basket while larger summer and fall performers mature. Lobelia thrives in damp, organically rich soils. If pruned after its spring show, they may reward you with an additional bloom in the fall. Usually do best in zones 10 and 11. Number three, impatience. Flowers come in a wide variety of hues, including pink, purple, lilac, red, orange, rose, white, and big colors, while the plants themselves are small and compact with glossy green foliage. They maintain a dazzling and continuous display of blooming from June all the way up to the first frost. These thrive in humus-rich, continuously moist soil and can withstand temperatures between 10 and 11 degrees Fahrenheit. By removing stems and leaves from immature plants, you can stimulate them to grow bushier and produce more flowers. Number four, monkey flower. The Mimulus ringens, or monkey flower, usually seen in shades of yellow, orange, and red, but also occasionally purple, these flowers bloom from June through September. There are upright types, and there are trailing types that are great for hanging baskets. One to three feet in height, and up to a foot in width. In addition to being tough from zone three to zone nine, the North American wildflowers known as monkey flowers thrive in wet, boggy areas. They prefer to grow in the shade and on soil that is not allowed to dry up. Number five, Collius Red Trailing Queen. Short, bushy plants whose leaves are the main attraction. Those velvety heart-shaped leaves are a sight to behold. They have a pale rose core and are a burgundy red with white to green edges. Countless forms and hues of caladiums are available. This is only one type of shade-loving plant that can be used as a magnificent accent or as the showstopper in a garden all by itself. The Climate Zone 11 is ideal for these plants. Well, thanks for watching video from Catchy Garden. Don't forget to click like and subscribe button to always support our channel. You can also turn on the notification bell to get the latest videos from us. We'll see you in the next videos.